Hi friends, welcome to Potty Talk. It's Rachel Lane. I know it's been a really long time. Um, just got a phone call. Had to deny that. Um, I totally don't have uh, much of a voice right now. I completely lost it yesterday. Oh, like nothing was coming out except for a few squeaks. So it's better today. But um, hang on, my kids are losing their minds. Back. So yeah, my kids are losing their minds. Um, it has been raining, like, monsooning the last several days, basically since last week, all last week. It's Monday now. It's raining today, and it's actually cool outside. Like, it's in the 50s, and I'm thinking, it's the end of April, for heaven's sakes. What in the world? Like, we just opened up the pool, and now it's way too cold. Now there's a baby knocking on the door. Anyway, so, following up on the craziness... I've noticed a lot of screaming in this house, and from the kids, too. <laughs> um, it's been coming from me and my husband a lot. Um, we've just all been cooped up. We're all short on patience. We're all driving one another insane. So, um, usually on Mondays, we... All sit together to do school we homeschool so we all sit together in the living room and I have a couple of those really giant uh, like post-it notes that I stick up on the wall and we'll write down a few sight words that everybody works on together that week um, a few like a topic that we want to learn together and we'll kind of work on that over the week and so I hadn't really decided yet what we were gonna study this week what topic we were gonna do but after an hour and a half this morning of nonstop screaming at each other, I decided I'm taking a note from When Calls the Heart. I know I've got to have some When Calls the Heart fans out there. Um, and we're going to make This Week Kindness Week. So I've been trying to decide what it is that we're going to do for Kindness Week. <coughs> the cat got shut up in here with me just a second. Find a getaway. Love on your mama. <laughs> Totally is not into it. Okay, so I'm thinking for Kindness Week, one thing that I'm going to do is um, have them all draw names and have it be kind of like a, um, like a Secret Santa type of deal, you know, where they uh, get a name and they have to give gifts to that person randomly throughout the week anonymously. So um, we're going to do that. And uh, I'll probably work with each kid individually after they draw their name to, like, brainstorm what they would like to do for that person this week and we're all going to talk about some verses from the bible on the tongue and the power of the tongue and the power of life and death being in the tongue um so we're going to talk about you know how god commands us to um speak life with our words and to not to tear one another down with our words because that's a lesson that not just kids need to learn but mamas and daddies need to learn too um, so we're going to work on that, and I'm going to do my very darndest best to update every day this week and kind of give you guys an idea of what we're doing each day for Kindness Week. Um, it's been a while since I've been on here. I know. I know. I kind of had given up there for a little bit because my phone went bonkers, y'all. It would not charge. It would charge but not turn on. It would turn on and then turn off, power off. And, like, do I have something on my teeth? I thought I had something on my teeth. Uh, anyways, <laughs> a squirrel. Um, so, uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, my phone. It would charge up, turn off, then power off at like 70% battery. It was insane. And then I finally got it to where it would charge up, stay on, and then my video editing app that I use was all wonkers. So, after trying to make a few videos and them not working and not being able to put it together, I just gave up for a while. I was like, I have enough on my plate. I'm not going to get stressed out over my phone. <laughs> so, um, but I'm back and hopefully we're going to be back in here every day this week so I can keep you updated on how kindness week is going. So, I hope you're having a good week. Tell me what it is that you do with your kids whenever they're all climbing the walls and everybody's losing their ever-loving minds. I'd love to hear ideas from you because I'm really kind of having to think deep and figure out what it is that we can do. But I'm excited. I think it'll be good for all of us, mommy, daddy, and kids alike. So, 
I'll give you an update tomorrow, and I can't wait to hear some of your ideas. Bye, guys.